Your back affects your daily health. Welcome to another installment of Your Spine, Your Health. Because you have a spine, it's important to understand what chiropractic care means to your health. Your health always starts with a regulatory college. In this case, the College of Chiropractors of BC serves to ensure you receive the appropriate diagnosis and care from a qualified chiropractic doctor today and tomorrow. That's also why BC's chiropractors fund research and education. Today, I want to introduce you to Dr. Jason Busse, who is going to talk to you about his research of predetermined outcomes. The idea that when a, a patient comes to their primary care provider with a complaint of low back pain, uh, that they could then be triaged for a specific spine assessment by either a physical therapist or a chiropractor that they're engaged with. And then based on those findings, they would work with the primary care physician to basically say, this is an individual that appears to be uh, in need of conservative care only. Here's an individual that seems to require advanced imaging. Here's an individual that seems to be a candidate for surgical assessment. Dr. Busse is adding to the research, explaining how chiropractic care can help improve the effectiveness of healthcare in Canada. Part of this investigation means addressing inefficiency in low back pain diagnosis and the overuse of advanced imaging equipment. Uh, primary care physicians are not always confident in their ability to assess uh, and diagnose low back pain, which tends to be a very challenging condition. If there's concerns about confidence, then it can be easy to use advanced imaging as sort of part of your assessment criteria as opposed to a way to rule in or rule out a diagnosis. The average wait for a surgical assessment in Canada is six months. If you are then scheduled for surgery, you could be looking at another six month wait. During this waiting period, many patients do not seek a second opinion from a chiropractic doctor. The other thing that we see is a lot of primary care physicians are referring their low back pain patients that fail to resolve for surgical assessment. Say, I don't know what's happening here, off to the surgeon you go. And when we surveyed Canadian spine surgeons, we found that 20% of the referrals that are made to them, they reject without a consultation. Out of the ones they do see, most surgeons have to screen at least 10 patients to find a single candidate that would benefit from surgery. Dr. Busse is proposing better examination and diagnosis for patients with spine-related conditions. His research explains and increases awareness of better assessment to determine who might need a surgical referral, reducing unnecessary referral, and longer wait periods. As you can see, it's not just about what we can do for you today. We're working to build a better tomorrow with better health outcomes for you. The College of Chiropractors of BC sets the standards for safety, outcomes, and your informed consent.